Hey welcome back everyone, in this series of video I am going to show you how to make an endless runner game using Unity Engine. It's like the Subway Surfer game, we are going to build this game from scratch using Unity Engine. As you can see this is the final result. We have this screen with tap to start text and uh, when I tap on the screen we have this wheel that is moving forward. I can use my swipe controls to move the wheel left and right. I can also slide to avoid this obstacle. We have some coins to pick up and also I can jump. I hope that you are excited about making this type of games. We are going to build it from scratch using Unity Engine. Even the 3D models like the traffic cone, the road and the wheel. We are going to make them using Blender which is a 3D software for making 3D models uh, but you can just download the assets that you are going to use from the link in the description you don't need to uh, build these models also I'm gonna put the link in the description for this game you can go to Google Play Store and uh, download it to test it and when I collide with one of the obstacles we have this game over screen with the two buttons replay and quit I can replay or quit the game when I hit the replay button we can replay the game over again and also I can quit so uh, let's get started so let's start by creating a new project open unity hub and let's make a new one using this full, full version you can use any version you want so there is no big difference Let's choose a name, for example, Endless Game. Make sure the 3D is selected. Then let's put it on my desktop. Select the folder. Then create. Probably you will get the default interface of Unity. Anyway, we are going to change it. So go ahead and select this icon and change it to uh, two by three. Then we are going to put the game view behind the scene over here. And we are going to make a game for Android. So go under file, build settings, and let's change the platform to Android. So select the Android icon. Switch platform. Then everything will uh, set up to be uh, for making an Android game. And over here you can change the from free aspect to uh, this size. For now we have just a default scene. Go under scenes folder. And let's rename this one to level. And we have just a main camera and a directional light. So in the next video we are going to start making uh, our new game. So if you enjoyed this video, give it a like and uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel and have a great day.